Hi students, good morning to everybody. This is Prasad Sir. In the previous classes, you learned about the term matter. So matter can exist in three states. What are they? Solid, liquid, gases. Here, solid, liquid, gases, gas. Here, solid will be changes into liquid, liquid will be changes into gases. Then you are applied the same amount of heat energy there. Okay. Suppose the state will be changes one state to another state. That means suppose solid will be changes into liquid. That is the melting point here, sir. Melting point. Otherwise, fusion. Fusion is there. What is the process? Of, what is the definition of melting point? The process of the process of solid heat changes into heat changes into liquid at a constant temperature at a constant temperature temperature. This process is known as a melting point. That means you are supplied the same amount of heat energy. Heat energy indicated as data. The next one, the liquid substance changes into gaseous substance. That process is known as a boiling point. Boiling point. Boiling point. Here, what is the definition of boiling point? What is the definition of boiling point? The process of the process of liquid liquid E changes into E changes into gases at a constant temperature at a constant temperature constant temperature this process is known as a boiling point okay the water will be changes liquid to gases that means the boiling point of water at the atmospheric pressure is how much of temperature is required? 100 degrees Celsius. Therefore, the boiling point of water is the boiling point of water is that 100 degrees Celsius. How much is there? 100 degrees Celsius. Suppose you line solid to liquid. One process, liquid to gases, second process. Here in the liquid to gases, another process is there. The evaporation, you know that evaporation, evaporation, evaporation. So what is the definition of evaporation? The process of, the process of liquid, E changes into, E changes into gases at any temperature at any temperature temperature this process is known as evaporation this process is known as evaporation the process of liquid changes into changes into gases at any temperature this process is known as a Evaporation. Okay, what are the main factors of the evaporation? There are mainly four factors are there. So, what are the important pro properties of evaporation? Is factors are there are mainly four factors. What are they? First one is there are mainly four factors. Four factors. What are they? First one is temperature. Temperature. And the second one is 
सरफेस ऑफ एरिया सरफेस ऑफ एरिया एंड थर्ड वन इज विंड स्पीड सो विंड स्पीड एंड फोर्थ वन इज ह्यूमिडिटी 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 मींस द अमाउंट ऑफ वाटर वेपर द अमाउंट ऑफ वाटर वेपर इज प्रेजेंट इन द एयर इज नोन एज ह्यूमिडिटी द अमाउंट ऑफ वाटर वेपर प्रेजेंट इन द एयर इज नोन एज ह्यूमिडिटी सो व्हाट आर द इंपॉर्टेंट मेन फैक्टर्स ऑफ ऑपरेशन देयर आर मेनली फोर फैक्टर्स व्हाट आर दे टेंपरेचर सरफेस ऑफ एरिया विंड स्पीड एंड ह्यूमिडिटी ओके हियर इज नेक्स्ट वन रिवर्स प्रोसेस इज देयर सर गैस एस टू liquid this is the first one this is the second one here is in, in this also has a third one is there and fourth one is there fourth one gas as to liquid this is one of the important main process that is the condensation process what is that the condensation process here condensation process condensation condensation process what is the definition of condensation process the process of gas molecules is converted into liquid molecule okay in the process the gas molecules are to lose their temperature to lose their temperature this process is known as a condensation process so next one the definition of condensation is the process of the process of gas molecules gas molecules is convert into convert into liquid 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 in the process in the process gas molecules are gas molecules are to lose their temperature to lose their temperature to lose their temperature this process is known as a condensation process this is one is condensation process okay suppose how can you tell this answer that i will give you some explanation in that suppose now take a glass tumbler now take a glass tumbler the glass tumbler will put on that the surface of the table this one has one of the table here this is a glass tumbler to pour the glass tumbler glass tumbler and pour the cold water pour the cold water pour the cold water after some time completed you are observed the surface of the glass tumbler have some water droplets at there water droplets water droplets will be appear on the surface of the glass tumbler so how can you form this water droplets how can you form the water droplets here definition of condensation is the process of gas molecules is converted into liquid in their process gas molecules are lost their temperature this process is known as a condensation process here in the surrounding area the glass tumbler has in the surrounding area so many air is there sir so many air is there 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 mixture of several gases air is a mixture of several gases suppose nitrogen gas is there 
oxygen gas is there, argon gas is there, neon gas is there, etc. So many gases are there. Suppose we, in atmosphere, the percentage of nitrogen is nearly 78%, and oxygen is 21%, and argon is 0.09%, neon is 0.01% is there. So, in the surrounding area, number of gases or molecules are there. These gas molecules are to lose their temperature. Temperature will be decreases. So these gas molecules are is converted into into liquid is there. Into liquid. So that's why it is one of the important process that one has condensation process. So gas molecules, and that means gases, hydrogen, oxygen, argon, neons, are converted into liquid. How? The in their process, gas molecules are to lose their temperature. Temperature will be lesser. That's why gas molecules are converted into liquid. Okay, this process is known as a condensation process. What is the main process? Condensation process. Okay. And the fifth one is here, yeah, fifth one is there. That is the liquid substance is converted into solid substance. That is solidification, otherwise called as a freezing point. Freezing point. Okay, once again, I raise the board. And next one is solidification. Solidification. Or freezing is there. Freezing. Solidification or freezing. Solidification or freezing. What is the definition of solidification or freezing? The process of liquid substance. The process of liquid substance is converted into solid substance. Okay. In the process, the liquid substance also to lose the temperature. That process is known as a solidification or freezing point is there. The process of the process of liquid liquid substance liquid substance is converting to converting to solid in the process in the process liquid liquid molecules molecules to lose their temperature to lose their temperature their temperature this process is known as a freezing point otherwise Solidification. Otherwise, solidification. Okay? And here, the freezing point of water is dash. That is the 0 degree Celsius. Okay? The freezing point of the freezing the freezing point of water is water is 0 degree Celsius. Okay? And the sixth one is the reverse process. The reverse, reverse process. And sixth one is the solid substance is directly changes into gases. The solid substance is directly changes into gases. Okay, and the reverse process also is there. The gas, the process of gas molecules is directly changes into solid. That is process known as a sublimation process. What is the process now? Sublimation process. Sublimation. Sublimation process. Sublimation process. Here, the process of the process of solid substance. Solid substance. Solid substance 
is directly 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 e changes into changes into gases this process is known as sublimation process this process is known as sublimation sublimation okay otherwise the process of gas gas substance is directly changes into solid this process is known as the sublimation for example here uh, iodine vapors are there ammonium chloride vapors are there such as like these are the example for the sublimation okay thank you and all